Oil, the number one globally traded commodity. The USA alone consumes 800 million gallons of crude oil every day. That's three gallons per person per day. Plastic packaging alone uses one pint. China needs 250 million gallons of crude oil per year just to produce ladies' tights. Current global consumption is 3.5 billion gallons per day and increasing. 85% of all crude oil is transported by sea. It is transported over the oceans by super tankers in the VLCC class, very large crude carriers. They are more than a thousand feet long and up to 200 feet wide. The deck has a surface of about 23,000 square yards. There is room on it for five jumbos. The vessel's superstructure is as high as the Brandenburg Gate. In fact, you could easily fit ten of them onto the deck. Each of the two anchors weighs 15 tons. The oil pumps force up to 4 million gallons per hour through the 4,000 feet long pipes. The engine's performance is 37,000 horsepower. It is four stories high and weighs 960 tons. The ship's propeller weighs more than 70 tons and is 35 feet in diameter. The rudder blade has the surface of a five-room apartment. The tanker has a capacity of 95 million gallons of crude oil. That is the equivalent to 4.5 million bathtubs, which, if they were lined up, would be 5,600 miles long. That's the distance from Texas to Dortmund, Germany. The vessel draws 75 feet of water. Two-thirds of the ship is underwater when it's fully loaded. Oh. 
The oil is secured by a 10 feet thick double hull that protects our environment and ensures attractive market conditions because all of the world's single hull tankers have to be replaced by new vessels in 2015. This will limit the global fleet's transport capacities and lead to higher charter rates. VLCC supertankers with double hull, the oil transportation of the future, and a dynamic and secure investment.